Welcome back now to Primetime Sports Friday. Let's kick off with some football. Four locally based members of the Reggae Girls World Cup squad left Jamaica on Friday, heading to an Adidas funded camp in Amsterdam ahead of the global showpiece in Australia. But as Karen Madden reports, talismanic captain Khadija Bonny Shaw was not among the players who left the island. National players Kanye Plummer, Denisha Blackwood, Judy Carter and Jody Brown, along with team manager Crystal Walters and head of delegation Elaine Walker-Brown, were upbeat as they got ready to board their flight for the two-hour trek to Panama before grueling 10-hour flights to Amsterdam. Following a successful local camp, the players will do final preparations in the Dutch capital before heading to their group games in Australia. At age 21, Florida State senior Jody Brown is heading to her second FIFA World Cup. Just going out there to compete. Um, I know we have to take care of our body because a lot of traveling. So we just got to go out there and be ready mentally and physically. So I think we just got to go out there and prepare ourselves for whatever. Brown joins teammates Denisha Blackwood and Trudy Carter, who are also making a return to the FIFA showpiece. Honestly, I wouldn't say nerves. I would say I'm going in with a lot of maturity, which I'm very happy for. I think last year was, you know, very last time I was very inexperienced, but this time I'm going with a little bit more maturity. And I think, yeah, you know, th there's always nerves where you man, but I think I'm just excited to just show what we can do. I'm very happy that I got picked in the squad at Amsterdam. I'm looking forward to to meet up with the girls, to have some friendly games and to get refocused from what happened back here in Jamaica and we're ready to put everything behind and just look forward to these games in Australia and New Zealand. And the former captain Kanye Plummer was pleased to have witnessed a milestone in her son's life before heading off to national duty. Honestly, it's a great feeling after being out for so long, just go, being at the airport representing Jamaica. It is a great feeling. I'm excited to be to meet up with the rest of the group. Oh, yesterday you walked, so I'm like, I'm just happy I get to experience this moment and hopefully join us. In recent weeks, head of delegation Elaine Walker Brown was involved in a public spat with the reggae girls, but she insists all that is behind them. This is an unfortunate situation, and we have we have moved on about two days after. Everything is okay, we are ready and rearing to go to represent, you know, so I'm here as the head of delegation to ensure that everything is in place for the girls to perform well on the field. It's understood that team captain Khadija Bunny Shaw will travel on Saturday. The players will be joined by the overseas members of the delegation, including head coach Lauren Donalds in the Amsterdam camp, before heading to Australia. Jamaica are drawn in Group F alongside France, Brazil and Panama. Karen Madden, TVJ Sports.